Uh, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Michaela Sala. I'm a member of the Parish Pastoral Council, the Vice Chair, as well as the Co-Chair of St. John Newman Young Adults. And I have the distinct privilege to talk to you guys today about Healing the Whole Person Seminar. So uh, Joe and Sharon reached out to me and thank you guys for that. Um, just perfect timing within my own life. And it's put on by John Paul II Healing Center and their mission is to create transformation in the heart of the church, which is exactly what we're here today talking about. And transformation can't happen in our hearts unless we're go willing to go to the places that are dark, unless we're willing to go to the places that usually we put over there, that we don't bring to the altar every Sunday, or if we do bring it to the altar, we kind of throw it at the cross and we run away. At least, you know, maybe that's just me. But this conference it was three or f three days. Yep, so Thursday night, Friday night, Saturday night, and it was at the beginning of February. And it was all virtual, so that was great because in my typical way, I managed to double book the weekend. So thankfully, I could watch Thursday night and then watch the rest of the, <clears throat> watch the, rest of the conference on my own at home. So the first night I was able to be in community here at St. John Newman, and then I was able to still participate. So if you have any concerns about giving up your weekend, you shouldn't. But this will be coming up again in May, or yep, April 29th through May 1st. And it's about 12 hours in total, with three hours for each session. And so the seminar's focus is to experience Jesus in his mission of healing physically, spiritually, and emotionally. We all have baggage, we all have pain, we all have things we don't want to go to. And Father Bob, his brother Bart, and Sister Miriam James, they help us to see and experience God's healing love through teaching, prayer, personal reflection, adoration, and the sacraments. It's like nothing I had ever experienced, not that I've gone to a ton of conferences, but it was very personal. We had the opportunity to look at healing the whole person. What does that mean? How do we do that with grace, with the empathy for ourselves? And then to face our brokenness, right? We don't want to sit and look at those things we shove off to the side. We want to shove them off and forget they're there. And in those places when we truly face it and we truly face it with Christ is we can sit in them. And when we can sit in them in the Father's love, that's transformational. And to be able to have that experience, I was very grateful for. And have since then been sitting in a lot of those places with the Father and with Christ to say, where do you want me to go from here? Because all of those places are our testimony. That's what sets us in fire. That's how we shine through our light, as Tony talked about. And so I encourage you, if you have the time, I'd encourage you to attend the next one. Um, it will be virtual, so for those of you watching virtually as well, you know, very attuned there. But I just encourage you to watch, so thank you.